Let me finish the introduction and then finish. Okay, that's right. Listen, 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 listen. Okay? We are gonna talk about some food, okay? Alright, your glass look cool on you too. You look like um you, you look like 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 flavor flavor <laughs> <laughs> flavor flavor. Anyway, so today I'm here with Chef Blake. How are you doing sir? You doing good, sir. Show? Okay, we are here with Chef Blake today and he's gonna take you guys on a cooking journey with some delicious, nice Jamaican food. Well, I guess Jamaican food is becoming all type of food because everybody loves Jamaican food. So American, Jamaican, African, wherever you're at, Chinese, India, we all love Jamaican food and we're in the kitchen today making some good Jamaican food. I'm gonna let Chef Blake introduce what he's doing, a little surprise, and he will be telling you guys what's up. Okay. So today we're gonna make some curry ox steel. Right here, looking pretty, looking good. Okay. So this is all my ingredient. I got my salt right here. I got Miss Dash right here. I got some curry right here and poultry right here. Turmeric right here. I got some jerk season right here. I got some all-purpose right here. So now I'm gonna season up. I got my cabbage right here. I got my coconut right here. I got a plantain right here. I got my onion. I got my red onion. I got my carrot. I got my bell pepper. Red pepper. And I got also got a green one. I got my scallion. And also we're gonna make some rice. And peas. Got my peas right here. So I'm gonna go and roll it. Boat. Okay, guys. Before we get started, I just wanna go over this, guys. This is the coconut. This is the coconut, and this is where the coconut milks come from. The one you find in the can. This is the natural coconut from the tree. So we're gonna have the natural coconut using today. We're not gonna use a can. So we're gonna put this in the blender. We're gonna cut this up and put it in the blender. And we're gonna blend it and get the juice out of it for our rice and a rice and bean, a nice Jamaican rice and bean straight from the coconut tree. So here we got it right here. We're gonna go ahead and cut it and put it in the blender over here. And also we have some beetroot. We have some beetroot, guys, fresh off the vine. I can see. I just pulled the vine off of it. It's fresh as you, as as they comes. Um, I have two of them, and I have some carrot here. And you may be wondering what I'm doing with it with beetroot and carrot. The carrot and the beetroot is gonna make some carrot juice with beetroot. So you're gonna have that beetroot health property. And I also have some ginger here. I'm gonna add some ginger in this. It's gonna be some carrot juice with beetroot and ginger. Guys, it doesn't get better than that. That's when an authentic Jamaican carrot beetroot juice. We usually make that on Sunday. So come with us and hang in this cooking journey. As I'm saying, Chef Blake gonna take over and gonna show you what's popping in Blake WR TV kitchen. Keep watching. Yes, guys. Welcome to WR TV. So today I'm gonna prepare some curry oxtail right here. Looking good. Okay. So this is all my ingredients. I got my salt right here. I got Miss Dash right here. Also got my curry. And my poultry seasoning. My turmeric jerk seasoning all purpose and right here i got my cabbage i got my coconut we also gonna make some rice and peas this is from this book this coconut is from rice and peas I also got my onion here i got a red onion i got my carrot i got my bell pepper and i got a bell pepper right here egg also and my scallion so check me out in the kitchen doing some cooking so this is the peas for the rice and peas so i'm gonna go, not go ahead i'll wash my peas okay remember you got to wash your peas okay So, 
very important you gotta wash your feet at least two times or three times Here also, I got four pegs of garlic. And remember, you gotta put a little bit of salt, not a lot. Little bit of salt like this. Okay. So now my piece on. I'm gonna go ahead and cover my pot. Okay. So. This is my ox steel right here. I'm gonna go ahead and wash my ox steel very good. Okay. Water right here. I'm also gonna put a little vinegar on my ox steel. Yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and give it a next wash. Alright. Looking good. So now my meat done washed, so I'm gonna go ahead and season up my ox steel right now right now I got a little all purpose so I'm gonna go ahead put in my all purpose and got some jerk sauce right here Turmeric right here. Also got some poultry seasoning. So I'm gonna go ahead and put a little bit of meat. So got also got a little bit miss dash I'm gonna go ahead add a little bit right here alright now my meat done season up so rubbing my seasoning yeah Of garlic. Yes, guy, look at my ox tail right here, looking good. So now I'm gonna go ahead and add my oil. Curry finish burn. Now I'm gonna go ahead and add my ox tail.
yeah, check out my curry peeps. Looking good, delicious. Yeah, that is my curry at steel. And also over here, I got my coconut right here for my rice and peas. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut up my coconut. And also, I'm gonna put it in the blender and I'm gonna blend it. So check me out cutting up my coconut. Yeah. Now I'm gonna add my coconut milk right here. So I'm gonna add it to my peas cooking. Okay. Yes people, I'll add my coconut so now I'm going to add my scallion and I'm going to add a little thyme and I got a teaspoon of sugar right here and I got a scotch burnet right here so I'm going to go ahead and stir this Two teaspoon of butter. Okay. Yes, now I'm gonna add my vegetable. So right here I'm gonna add my bell pepper, my red bell pepper. Red. And I got some green bell pepper right here. Right here I got some carrots. Right here I got some scallion. I also got some white onion right here. And got some red onion. I got some scotch bonnet prepper right here. Alright. Okay, looking good, looking delicious. Yeah. Looking good. Hey guys, welcome back. We still in the kitchen. And um, I'm telling you guys, it's been a long day, long process. We've been cooking just for you guys. You can see some delicious curry, oxtail, long with rice and beans with coconut milk, all the good delicious food we've been cooking all day. Thanks to Chef Quincy, this has been the kitchen. Chef Quincy has been hooking us up with some good food. First we're going to start off guys and let you guys see what the curry oxtail look like. So this is the curry oxtail, all cooked down and steamed down with all the good vegetables and delicious taste, very palatable. You know what I mean? This is what it looks like. And over here we got our our rice and bean pot. We got a scotch bonnet pepper on top. Definitely we're gonna move that. That thing is hot. So it's delicious. Rice and bean all cooked down with coconut milk. And we have some you know what this is. This is this is some um coleslaw here with this cabbage and um shredded cabbage with carrots mayonnaise all the good stuff in there so we're gonna go ahead and show you some fry planting we did over here some fry plantings so we're just gonna make that on the side of the plate as a little treat on it as well and we did the carrot juice earlier along with the beetroot so we're gonna go ahead and eat some food so in the next clip you're gonna see us with all the plate we're gonna make some plates so you guys can look at what we got going on in Blake WR TV kitchen so don't go nowhere hey guys Look at that, this delicious food. Look at it. Take a look at this food, guy. This is our nice rice and bean with coconut milk, along with the um, oxtail, the plantain, the coleslaw. This thing look delicious. Okay, so we've been cooking all day, so I'm gonna go ahead and try some of this. Mm, the rice alone tastes good. This rice is delicious. Coconut milk tastes good in the rice, man. Yeah. I couldn't do it better myself. It's well good. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Coleslaw tastes good too. Yeah. 
Guys, this food is really tasting good. Gotta take my hats off for this one. Mmm, dark stale, wow. You know, it's the first time I'm having curry. Oh, really? Yep, with ox tail. I went to curry chicken, but I've never tried ox tail with curry. Oh. So, this is first, guys. The first time I'm trying ox tail, curry ox tail. And trust me, this is surprising. It's delicious. I couldn't believe it. I definitely gotta do this again because this tastes good. Curry ox tail. Now, I always think curry wasn't only for like curry goat, curry chicken. But I never tried an ox tail, guys. Delicious. Mm. There's all the seasoning in here. It's so good. Mm -hmm. Delicious. Nice. Mmm. This thing tastes good, man. Real good. And the oxtail is soft and tender. Yeah. This cooks all the way through. Mmm. Let me stick it up with one like this. Mmm, it's perfect with the coleslaw. Yeah. Let me try a little bit of that planting. Yeah. It tastes real good. It doesn't get better than this, guys. Food nice. Mm hmm This oxtail is one of the best. It's soft, tender, sweet, juicy. Mmm. How did you make the rice and bean? What do you put in there? You know, I put whatnot milk. I put a uh, little bit of sugar. Nothing tastes good. And I put scallion, thyme. Yeah. Mm hmm. Yeah, it's man, really like nice. I said. It's a real chef, man. Food tastes good. Check me out on the next episode. Like, subscribe, and comment. Comment. Get some last more good food. Here you are. I only had Blick Double R TV cooking this delicious food. Very nice, very palatable, delicious. It doesn't get better than this. It's soft, juicy. I'm hungry. I'm out. Soft and juicy oxtail, rice and bean. Fry planting and coleslaw, guys. It doesn't get but hey, I forgot one more thing. I gotta get some of my juice. Hey guys, we definitely gotta try the juice. I'm gonna have Chef Quincy tell you about the juice because I made it and it's delicious, but I taste it, but I don't wanna be the judge of that. I want him to taste it. So go ahead and try your glass and let me know what you think. Do that toast. <laughs> you forgot the toast. <laughs> anyway, so what do you think? Yeah, this thing looks very nice. Delicious. You can't taste the ginger inside of it. Yeah, it's real good. Yeah, very healthy for you guys. Yeah. Make this at home. I think it's you should good. try this. It's good. It's one of the best juice with all the health property and benefit. Carrot, beetroot, and ginger. With some sugar and lemonade, lemon lime. It's good. Real good. You nail this one. Mm -hmm. So thank you for watching. Remember, if you like this video, give us a thumbs up, guys, for a lot of work. We make a video for you guys. A lot of work in cooking. Make it to bring it to the table. This delicious dish. You can see what curry oxtail looks like. The nice delicious rice and beans cooking and making all the good stuff in there. Give us a thumbs up, like, and if you feel, consider subscribing to our channel. We do have a more delicious food like this coming up. Come up on Blake's WRTV. Thank you for watching.